Hey guys, welcome back to this week's video. Um, this video right here is going to be all about basically pigeons. Um, and there'll be some noise in the background because of ducks and pigs, so yeah. But pigeons, they are full size for all of these are full grown pigeons, males and female pigeons. Um, the males are typically a lot more bigger than the females. Um, I um, breed mine and then I just hatch them out and then they just fly right here. These are, I'm going to say they, they are homer pigeons, means if they fly um, off. But if you take them off somewhere, they will fly right back to where they originally came from. Um, I've, I've currently, right now, I have got 11 or 12 pigeons. Um, I have two more um, eggs down here. I got one that's in the corner back there, and I think that white one there if y'all can see her see her she is about to lay an egg um in like i guess in a couple minutes or a couple days um they lay to two eggs one's a male and one's a female and as soon as they hatch and get old enough them two will pair up and then they will lay another egg and it just keeps going on um they're very easy to take care of um the um, these are my newer pigeons. The solid white one is a newer one. Um, that one there is a newer one. The one beside of that is a newer one. The one up on the cage is a newer one. And there's another one here somewhere. He's right there. I just flew. Um, so I got quite a few of newer ones. Um, they're not, they're a lot more skittish. So they ain't really um, handleable, handleable but, but they will fly, as you can tell. And if you ain't careful, you get whacked in the face by a pigeon when they fly. Ah, you little vomit. Um, but they're very fun to have. So, um, yeah, y'all are too. Get the ducks back there quacking. Um, their maintenance is very um, low. Um, all you do is basically just feed them cracked corn and you give them like water dishes for them to drink out of or take a bath in. Um, um, but the baby, um, baby pigeons. You do have to watch them, especially if you if you have a rat infestation, um, because the rats will eat the babies um, when they're about, I'm say about a week old, a couple weeks old, somewhere in there. Um, I would have had more pigeons than what I already have right now, um, but some of them got eaten before they got. Um, big enough to fly out of their nest. Um. I ain't talking to you. Um, but yeah, but they're pretty fun to have. Um, I like coming out here messing with them, but they're still a little skittish. Um, they, um, don't really like other animals being around them. Um. When the males are kind of like ready to mate with the females, they kind of make like a loud sound, basically. It just sounds like a very angry pigeon. Um, they do need some perches. What I just use for theirs is a wooden stick and a PVC pipe, and it works just fine. And when they land on it, it does do that, so. But they like it, so that's all that matters, I guess. Then their land box is just a cage with a tarp over it. Um, they like laying in it. They have a lay box, but they don't really use it. Just some use it, some don't. Um, 
the white ones right here be her second one, second or third one of this year, laying for me. So that's pretty good. Um, but they're pretty fun. Um, they eat twice a day. Um, crack corn, and they don't really seem to mind eating it. Um, they get along just fine with other pigeons. Um, they get they got along fine with my chickens, um, but they didn't really like them being around um, them. Um, but they got along with them. They didn't really care for them, but they got along. Um, so now we have them in a dog kennel, basically. Um, that's big enough for these many pigeons, and they just do their normal pigeon thing. Um, but probably like in the farther future. It seems I get more pigeons, um, where it starts getting just a little crowded up in their pigeon coop, basically. I will probably be selling some, um, but I will be selling them as a pair as soon as I get enough built up where their cage is getting overcrowded and stuff like that. Um, basically, when I do sell them... Um, they will have their feathers and up moving around off, you know, eating corn, crack corn, basically. And then I will start selling them. But right now, um, I want my pigeons kind of up higher. Like, the number of pigeons I have, I want them up higher up. Um, then I start selling them. Then as soon as I start getting down, then I'll stop selling them. Then, you know, stuff like that. Um... You don't say. Apparently they want to be in this video too. Are you good now? Okay. But they do get down on the ground sometimes. And going into the lay box. Um... talking about y'all thank you um but half these pigeons are in here um that are paired up our brother and sisters um um but when they're first born um they normally have a male and a female then the male and the female that the parents hatched out then they'll pair up and yeah but they get along just fine together i got two in here that look exactly the same and I got another uh, paired up over there that look exactly the same. So, um, that one right there, the one that's a little bit more lighter, is, um, a son or a daughter to that one there. That's looking at me a little funny. Um, I've actually not had a pigeon not take care of its baby. Um, all of my pigeons are good um, parents. Um, but yeah. But they're doing pretty good. Um, yeah. He knows I'm talking about him. So he's going to do all that dancing and stuff like that. But other than that, um, they're pretty good. Their care level is pretty easy. Um, so I don't have to worry about like stuff like that. Um, with their like cage and stuff like that, um, I recommend them being outside. Um... They rather live in a barn, basically, um, but where I got neighbors that does not really like pigeons in their barns, so we gotta have to keep them in a coop, but they don't mind, um, they're pretty docile, sort of, ish, um, but other than that, they're pretty good, so. But that's it for this video. If y'all have any questions um, about my birds here, my pigeons, um, or something like that, I hear you back there. Um, that one there is a male, and that's the sound it makes. Ha <laughs> ha! She didn't care for you. But that is a male pigeon. That makes that type of noise.
So. Okay, you two. But that's it for this video. If you have any questions for me um, about my pigeons or the donkey and the pony back there, um, let me know in the comment section below. And um, yeah, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe, turn that bell notification on so you don't miss out of any of my future videos or upcoming videos. And if y'all want me to to do a video on noise boxes back there and my chickens let me know in the comments below or y'all want me to do a video on them too so yeah that's it for this video and thank y'all for watching